Hello Bulldogs, this is Keith Roth, proud principal of Brandywine High School. I'm here to welcome you to the 2020-2021 school year, and I'd like to extend a special welcome to our new freshmen, the class of 2024. I have some important information for you about remote learning. While we certainly wish that we could be together under the roof of Brandywine High School this fall, we are also excited to work with you in a new format. I want to be sure that you know that remote learning this fall will be a completely different thing than what you experienced last spring. For example, students will be required to meet remotely with every class twice per week for a full class period and show that you have mastered the material and to earn your grades as you would in a regular school year and to engage in special sessions each morning and on Wednesdays. Attendance will be taken in each class and assignments will be required. Before I get into just a couple of the details, I want to mention that, like so many other things, remote learning is what you make of it. You may be tempted to take a shortcut or two, to use an electronic resource when you know you shouldn't. Please remember that sooner or later, we will return to in-person instruction and you will need the information that you should have learned during remote instruction. Shortcuts may get you to the other side of an assignment, but they won't give you anything that you can take with you and use in the future. A couple of suggestions for your at-home classroom space. Try to find a quiet space. Be mindful of backgrounds because we require that your video be turned on and try to treat the remote classroom the way you would treat your regular classroom at school. That said, it is also important that you find times to take a movement break and to make sure to take the opportunity to get offline during lunch. Parents, a virtual open house is in the planning stages and we are working on providing you an opportunity to meet with each of your child's teachers shortly. Stay tuned. Lastly, to all Bulldogs, we know that these are very difficult times. We, the United States, are struggling in so many ways right now. Not the least of which is to acknowledge the inhumanity that has been and continues to be perpetuated on members of the black community. We are working hard to look in the mirror as individuals and as a school to understand and address our shortcomings and to make sure that every Bulldog is treated with respect and given every opportunity to reach their full potential. Students, given opportunity, hard work, and dedication, you will succeed in reaching your goals. Please call if you need anything this fall. And now, Mr. Murphy. Hi, I'm Byron Murphy. I'm one of the assistant principals here at Brandywine. I'm also a Brandywine alum from the class of 1983. I supervise the math department and the English department. I'm also in charge of all aspects of school safety. Perhaps my most important responsibility here at Brandywine, though, is for a program that we call Freshman Focus. This program is designed to make sure that every ninth grader gets everything that they need to be successful. The program includes a variety of supports for ninth graders. Those supports include a freshman seminar program that is designed to ease the transition from middle school to high school, after school help sessions, and a staff specifically selected for their skill at working with ninth graders and their desire to work with this particular population of students. My contact information is at the bottom of the screen, as is a link to the parent student handbook for the freshman focus program where you can get a great deal of additional information. Thanks for choosing Brandywine for your student. I hope you have a great school year. Hello Bulldogs, my name is Mr. O'Hanlon. I'm the assistant principal here at Brandywine High School. We're starting off the 2020-21 school year a little bit differently than we have in the past, but it's okay. We're in this together. We're going to come out stronger together. If I can be of any assistance for you, please let me know. I oversee the students with the last names A through K uh, here at Brandywine High School, but certainly I'm more than happy to help the families, uh, all families here at Brandywine. If you have any questions, shoot me an email on the website or Schoology. I'm more than happy to help. 
Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Lum, your Dean of Students here at Brandywine High School. Welcome to the 2021 school year. I look forward to eventually hearing from you and hopefully in the near distant future, I'll get a chance to see you as well. If you have any questions around student code of conduct and equity here at Brandywine High School, please be sure to reach out to me. Again, look forward to hearing from you all. Take care. Whatever happened to predictability? The milkman, the paper boy, the evening TV. You miss your old familiar friends waiting just around the bend. Everywhere you look, everywhere there's you a go. heart, there's a heart, a hand to hold on to. Everywhere you look, everywhere there's you look. look. Hi, and welcome to Brandywine High School. I'm Lauren Anderson, your vocal music, piano, and drama director. It's definitely going to be a different kind of year, especially in the performing arts. But I have to tell you, I'm really excited to get started. It's definitely going to be way different than this spring. So you'll access all of your information in Schoology, and I use Home Access Center to email parents and guardians as well. And when we start working in borderless classrooms, we will be going over music theory, a little bit of music history, we'll do some conducting, and we'll be incorporating smart music and music first into every lesson, as well as live music making. So get ready to start to sing. I can't wait. I can't wait to meet you all, and I can't wait to go through this together. It's gonna be a challenge, but I know we can do it. See you soon. Hi everyone, I'm Mrs. Adams and I'll be teaching math as part of the freshman focus team. I'll be teaching Algebra 1, Honors Algebra 1, and Freshman Seminar. This is my eighth year of teaching and my second year at Brandywine. I've taught freshmen almost every year that I've been teaching. Last year I only had one section and I asked to be moved to the freshman focus team so I could teach predominantly freshmen. I love helping you get acclimated to high school. I know this is a really unusual year to be doing that, but I think if we all remain positive, work really hard and stay patient with one another, it's gonna be a really good experience. Some of the things that we will be using, we'll be using Schoology for everything to access all of our other materials. Um, when we meet for synchronous learning, that means live learning, we will be using Borderless Classroom. We'll be using Desmos, which is a free online graphing calculator, which also has a lot of really cool classroom activities that we will do. We'll use Flipgrid to record some videos, and we'll also use the Google Suite for education. So things like Google Docs and slides and forms. I know throughout the year that we will add more apps and programs, but for now, this is what we're gonna focus on. I can't wait to see you, get to know you, enjoy your last few days of summer, and we'll see you soon. Welcome back, Bulldogs. My name is Mr. Bernard, and I've been a special ed teacher here at Brandywine for the last nine years. What I'm looking forward to most this year is just pushing myself outside my comfort zone with all the challenges that remote learning is going to present. I hope you guys have a great year. See you around. Hi, my name is Rachel Blumenfeld. I teach 10th grade English and 11th grade AP Language and Composition. I'm going to put everything for my classes on Schoology and I'll send out course updates that way as well. And I'm very fortunate because I've had many of my students before, so I look forward to seeing them again and getting to know all of my new students and I can't wait to start the year. Hi, I'm Suzanne Bounds. I'm the Building Special Education Coordinator. This is my first year at Brandywine High School and I'm really excited to become a Brandywine Bulldog. Hello, Brandywine Bulldogs. My name is Miss Brown and I teach dance and fitness ed at Brandywine. If I'm lucky enough to have you as a student, you'll be able to find me 
on the Schoology course load page. I can't wait to start. It may be a little weird, but eventually we'll be back in the building. And while we're at home, let's have a great time. Go Bulldogs. Hi everyone, my name is Miss Campanella. Most of you know me as Miss Camp, soon to be Mrs. Thompson because I'm getting married within the next month. It's my seventh year teaching and I'll be teaching special education. My background the last couple years have been in math, but I'm super excited for this new adventure. I'll be co-teaching Algebra 1 and Geometry classes as well as my academic support classes. As we all venture into this new school year, things might look a little different with remote learning. However, we are all in this together and the key to this year is patience. Patience with school, classes, peers, teachers, and parents. But remember, we're all in this together. I'm here to support you with whatever you need, and I can't wait to meet you all very soon. See ya! Hey everybody, I'm Mr. Campbell, otherwise known as Senora Campbell and sometimes Coach Campbell. I'm uh, coming to you in my seventh year of teaching Spanish here at Brandywine, and I'm glad that you're going to be a part of this. Brandywine is a great place where uh, students are really connected to each other. They're proud of uh, being a Brandywine Bulldog, and uh, our school is one of the most connected uh, schools to the community that it serves. Good afternoon, my name is Madame Cécile and I will be teaching all the levels of French here at Brandywine High School. I'm definitely happy that you decided to take French or that you decided to pursue your studies of the French language and culture. If you need to contact me, the best way to reach me is via email. I'm here to support you in any way and uh, I'm sure that we are going to have a great remote uh, learning experience. But again, remember to be patient with yourself and be patient with me as your instructor. Now remember that the remote learning in the fall is not, to, is not going to be like the remote learning experience that you had in the spring. Your, attend, your attendance and timely work completion will directly impact your learning and your grades. Your learning, your learning will follow the district's curriculum and standard. When it comes to attendance, you are required to be logged in synchronously, live learning on Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. And during that time, you will need to make sure that you are uh, engaged. Um, you need to be engaged during our video conferencing sessions on borderless classroom during your scheduled class. And I will check your activity report there to check your attendance. Uh, your attendance will then be recorded in eSchool. On Wednesday, it will be the same way. It will be asynchronous though, but I will still be checking uh, your attendance and you will have until midnight to uh, post your work. So your expectations when it comes to video conferencing are simple. You need to be, um, you know, you need to create your own little learning space for learning. You need to make sure that you have all your learning material uh, before the beginning of class. Uh, be on time, turning your camera, mute your uh, microphone, especially if you're not speaking. And you can choose to wear earbuds or a headphone if you wish. The key is for you to remain engaged, just like you would in a normal classroom setting. Ask questions as well. Make sure that you are dressed appropriately. And please, please do not take videos or screenshots of others while on the video conferences. I will be using Schoology to post the lesson plans, worksheets, YouTube videos, etc. And that's where you will be able to find all the necessary information. I will make sure that everything will be properly marked on each folder. For example, remote learning week of, and I will mention uh, the particular week. I will be using Borderless Classroom to teach you remotely. You will also have uh, access to the digital version of our textbook. And again, you just need to go on, uh, on Schoology and then Clever, and then that will take you to, um, to our textbook, Tébranché. 
the format basically of the lesson will not change. You will see it will be all be a question of routine. We will start with a warm up, followed by three learning activities and, it, and their matching assessments. And uh, then we will complete the lesson with uh, some type of summarizing activity. I will communicate with you on a regular basis using Schoology as my main platform. And if I need to communicate with your parents or guardians, I will do so via uh, email or phone call. Now, do not worry, there will be more information coming to you way soon. And again, if you have any questions or concerns, do not hesitate to contact me and I will do my best to um, answer your questions and concerns. Thank you and have a wonderful year at Brandywine High School. Hello, parents and students. I'd like to welcome you back to the 2020-21 school year. I'm a teacher at Brandywine High School. My name is Margaret Crowley. I'm a special educator. I work in the ILP program along with Ms. Karen Lordy. And we look forward to seeing all of our students coming back to us from last year and welcoming all the new incoming freshmen to Brandywine High School. Uh, I hope you're excited about starting a brand new and very unique school year that's new to all of us and we're all in this together. It's going to be a challenge. It's going to be different, but we can do it. And uh, we're hoping to see you all soon in the hallways or on the screens or in the classrooms, virtual classrooms, living rooms, wherever you may be. And um, we hope to see you soon and come visit us. We're in rooms 125 and 126. Bye. Hi, everybody. My name is Miss Dillon, and I have been teaching art at Brandywine since 2009. I'm holding the camera up like this so you can see my beautiful still life. Anyway, I'm sure we'll make this remote learning work if we uh, stick together and work hard. I know it'll be different, but I'm looking forward to it and I'm looking forward to meeting everybody and getting on with it. See you soon. Hi everybody, my name is Mr. Donnelly and I'll be your health education this teacher this year. I've been at Brandywine for about 17 years. I love our Brandywine community. I love my colleagues and, and our, our students. Um, this summer I've been spending some time gardening and taking a lot of long walks. I love the outdoors and I love to fish. Um, and But now we're getting ready to transition back into our virtual classrooms. Uh, we'll be learning some new technologies together. In class we'll learn about how to keep well physically, mentally, and emotionally. We'll learn about the importance of mindfulness. And we will see you very shortly. I'll communicate with you through Schoology. If anybody has any questions, feel free to reach out. I really look forward to meeting you all. Have a great day. Hey everybody, I'm Dave Arrow. I teach biomedical science here as part of one of our CTE pathways. I know a lot of you guys because you're already in your second and third year of the program, but for those new students who are going to be joining us in year one, PBS, I'm looking forward to meeting you. This is going to be a great year. We've put a lot of time and a lot of effort in making sure that we do this as best we can, that we do it right. So who am I and why am I going to be your teacher? Well, we're going to spend most of our time, obviously, using the computer. And to make things simple, I've combined everything that we're going to use into one place. We're going to use Schoology. We're going to get content from lots of other places, but we're going to get there through Schoology to try and make this as simple and confusion free as it can be. Now, that's going to mean we're going to need a lot of communication. We're going to need to be able to reach each other easily. So if you're a student watching this, the main way that I want to be able to communicate with you is using your mind. You may have used it at one of your other schools in the past. It's simply the best way for us to be able to get a message to one another quickly. Because for a lot of what you're going to be doing, waiting 
24 hours for me to get back to an email isn't going to work for you. Remind is going to let you reach out to me and if you have a quick question, I can give you a quick answer and you can get on with doing what you need to do. For parents, you're going to use email. Um, I do check my email every day and I will get back to you. Um, and if you want a little bit more sort of insight into the courses, you can sign up to be a parent in both the Schoology classes and in Remind. And that's going to allow you to both see the content we're covering in Schoology, see what assignments are coming up, as well as um, be able to get the messages that I'm sending to your students so that you know the answers to the questions before you ask them. So who am I? Well, this is my 29th year here at Brandywine. There's only one other teacher who has been there longer than me. In that time, I've taught every one of the biology classes that we've offered from CP to AP, as well as some electives that we phased out when we knew we were going to be moving towards this biomed program. We had human anatomy, microbiology, medical terminology, and we taught some of those for a long, long time here. But honestly, the biomedical science program is better. Um, I'm also an adjunct at Dell Tech, where I teach human anatomy, mostly to students in the nursing program. I've been doing that for six years. And for doing this class, if there was something I didn't know from my 29 years of teaching this, um, I learned it when I had my 240 hours of professional development training to become certified to teach biomedical science. And that's a real 240 hours sitting in a classroom at a college, sleeping in the dorms at night over a span of three separate summers. It's an incredible learning experience and that's what I'm looking forward to passing on to the students. If you're in the program already, you know how excited I am about doing this. For those of you guys who are just going to be joining us, I can't wait to give you the experience that hopefully will change your life. All right. Well, look forward to seeing you guys. Take care. Bye. Hey, everybody. This is Mr. Erskine. You can see that I teach Algebra 1, Honors Geometry, AVID 10, and the Freshman Seminar courses this year. This is my 18th year, I'm sorry, 17th year at Brandywine High School. Uh, I've taught all these courses before, and so I kind of know what's going on as far as content. What's new is how we deliver them this year. I promise you it will be different than in previous years, even different than in the spring. Okay. Uh, uh, but together, we're going to get through it. Some of the cool things we're going to try this year, we're getting training on right now at the beginning of the year here, is Screencastify, Google Suite, which includes the slides and the forms, which I really like doing those. Ed Puzzle, where we get to watch videos and there's going to be um, questions embedded in there. Desmos, which has some really, really cool activities for us to look at. YouTube has some good videos for you guys to watch. We use that more for remediation if you need to. Like if you get stuck on something, you can go back and look at those. Uh, there's a new one, which is the TBC logo there. That's the borderless classrooms. That's one where we're going to be doing a lot of our videos right through there. Our, our synchronous, real-time kind of learning will be going through there. Screencastify is the one where we're going to make some videos. You probably guys will make some video, videos for me as well. But the one that we are going to have most contact with is Schoology. That's the one you guys are most familiar with. That's the one where we'll be doing uh, the communication back and forth and where most of our assignments will be housed. If you have questions, obviously you can reach out to me going through Schoology. You can email me as well, but Schoology is probably going to be your best bet. No matter what happens in the weeks to come until we get back into the classroom, this is the one we have to practice the most. We have to practice patience. Patience with one another, 
patience with mom and dad, patience with me, my patience with you. Um, this is a new platform for us all to be trying to figure out. So let's just be patient with one another. We will work it out. I promise you, I am here to support you. All I ever ask you to do is try. You're gonna be hearing a lot more videos on attendance and everything else. We'll get that more to come as we go through. I'll be making some smaller videos when it gets closer to the actual time and we'll start teaching you how to use some of these programs. Until then, I hope you have a great day and I can't wait to see you guys in your faces and when we get back to school. Good morning, Brandywine High School family. I am Beryl Gamiel. I'm the nurse. I've been here, I think this is my sixth year, but I know some of the students from some of the other schools where I've been. I am a result of Brandywine School District. I graduated from Mount, Mount Pleasant. My oldest daughter graduated from Concord, and now I'm here at Brandywine. So I want to welcome you all. Please feel free to contact me via email, beryl.gamiel at bsd.k12.de.us or call me anytime, 479-1602. I look forward to getting to know each and every one of you. And again, welcome. Welcome back, Brandywine students. My name is Ed Gibbons. I am the department chair for social studies. Uh, normally each year I teach juniors and seniors uh, psychology and United States history. Uh, most of my classes are completely integrated with Schoology. So all announcements, emails, assignments, grades will be published, posted, and go through Schoology. Uh, it makes it easier for the students and the parents um, basically to stay in tune access all the information at any point in time, morning, afternoon, or evening. Uh, my other goal, whether we're virtually or brick and mortar, is to make sure that the classroom environment feels safe, secure, and as comfortable as possible. In closing, I'm looking forward to meeting each and every one of you on September 16th so that I can share my passion of social studies with each and every one of you. Until then, uh, stay safe, stay strong, and stay positive. Hi, my name is John Gunther. I teach English here at Brandywine High School. This will be my third year at Brandywine. This year I'll be teaching 11th grade English as well as AP seminar. I also am the head coach of the boys lacrosse team. Uh, I love being a Bulldog because I love being active in the community and hope to meet you soon. Hi, I'm Mrs. Hackenstaller. Most students call me Ms. Sage. I will be co-teaching world history with Ms. Lambert and Mr. Houck. I will also be co-teaching one section of U.S. history with Mr. Smeeter. It's been a rough summer for many of us. Know that you will persevere. We will learn from each other and keep moving forward. Can't wait to meet you all. See you soon. Hi, Brandywine. My name is Ms. Herkimer. I am one of the special education teachers here at Brandywine High School. This is my second year of teaching and my first year at Brandywine High School. I'm so excited to be coming back home to the Brandywine School District as I am a Concord High School graduate. If you all need anything, please reach out to me or any of our staff. I know that this school year is going to look a little bit different than most, but I'm still really excited to get it started. My email address is located on the Brandywine High School website under our staff directory. I hope you all have a great start to the year. Go Bulldogs! Hello, my name is T.C. Hill. I'm a teacher assigned to Brandywine High School within the Brandywine School District. Uh, my content areas of instruction are biology, applied chemistry, and academic support. I have been at Brandywine High School now for two years, going on three. Um, and when I reflect on the qualities it takes to be a Brandywine Bulldog, I think of two words. Those two words are tenacity and perseverance. If you think of a Bulldog, a Bulldog is not gonna let go until it gets what it wants. And tenacity is that stick to itness that we need to have this 2020 and 2021 school year. 
there are going to be some obstacles along the way with us still learning how to use our virtual learning tools, but we will persevere. So go Bulldogs. Hello, I'm Mr. Holman. I've been teaching here at Brandywine for 18 years. I teach English. This year I'll be teaching mostly 10th grade English and I have one random 12th grade class. I look forward to seeing you soon. Good morning, Brandywine. My name is Mr. Houck. I would like to welcome you to uh, the 2020-2021 school year. Uh, another awesome year at Brandywine High School. Uh, if you're watching this video, you're either in one of my classes, AP Human Geography, uh, AP World History, or CP World History. Uh, I just wanted to say hi to you guys. I'm looking forward to meeting everybody, uh, and it's going to be an awesome school year. So I'll see you guys soon, and if you have any questions in the meantime, please email me, uh, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Have an outstanding day, and we'll talk soon. Thanks. Hello, my name is Dr. Rickus and welcome to Remote Learning at Brandywine High School. I'm a special educator. I co-teach biology and academic support. I'm looking forward to working with both parents and students this fall. If you look to the side, you'll see my contact information. I'll see you in the classroom. Hi, Brandywine students. My name is Mr. Julian, and I teach physical education and lifetime fitness. I've been teaching at Brandywine for six years now and coaching soccer and baseball for seven. I am looking forward to this new remote learning experience and looking forward to meeting you all. I'll be doing most of my teaching from my basement, which is where I currently am, and I'm looking forward to the beginning of this year. Bye, and I will meet you all soon. Hi, I'm Mrs. Kathleen Kelly, and I teach math here at Brandywine High School. I teach both CP and Honors Geometry and CP and Honors Algebra II, and I've been doing it for two years before now. This is my third year as a Bulldog. Before this, I taught 20 years in Texas, all different levels of math. I really like being a Bulldog because the students I have found to be so enthusiastic and wanting to learn and I really look forward to getting a new group this year. Welcome to the 2021 school year. My name is Mrs. Kidder and I'm a math teacher and department chair at BHS. I have been teaching for 35 years and during that time my own children attended BHS. So for this year, I will be teaching math and personal finance, honors pre-calc, Calculus AB and Calculus BC. Even though our start is unusual this year, I am looking forward to a very exciting year and trying new things. There will be some new technology as we will be using borderless classrooms to teach live lessons. If you had me last year, I did this through Schoology. Schoology though is still our main resource. You will find all of your lessons, notes, homework, etc., on Schoology. Everything you need to know will go through Schoology. What will be different than last spring is that you will have more graded assignments, including summative grades and attendance requirements. When you go to school to pick up your Chromebook, or if you already have, um, if Calc AB and Pre-Calc need to pick up a textbook, and if you don't have a graphing calculator of your own at home, you also need to pick up one of those. For BC, most of you have your books, but if you turned it in in June, then you need to pick one up. And if you need a calculator, please email me. For math and personal finance, you do not need to pick up anything from school. If you have any questions, please email me with anything that you need to know. So I just wanted to introduce myself and tell you what I'm really excited about working with all of you this year. On Wednesday the 16th will be our first day of school and you will meet with all eight of your classes. Then on Thursday the 17th, it will be an A day. I ask that you be patient and we will get through this virtual learning together. And I can't wait to see all of you when we get back to school. Please email me with any questions that you have. Thank you.
Welcome Brandywine High School students to the 2020-2021 school year. And this is different. Um, my name is Mrs. Lambert and I teach ninth grade civics and economics and 10th grade world history. This is my 16th year teaching, which means I started teaching when I was five, right? Uh, but I'm actually relatively new to the Brandywine School District. I started at Brandywine High School this past January, uh, just two months before the school closed due to COVID-19. Like you, I was disappointed and not the least bit stressed that our school year went virtual. I really miss seeing your faces and being in the classroom with you. Online teaching and learning is just not the same. However, I am really excited to start this new school year with you, even if we have to do it virtually. Some of you already know me as your teacher from ninth grade. I hope that takes away a little bit of the stressfulness of a new school year, new teachers. And if I taught you last year, then you already know how I am as a teacher. I like structure and consistency, and I expect and challenge the most out of you. This is not going to change in our virtual classroom. As we begin this new school year, all of your teachers want to make it clear that learning is going to look different than it did at the end of last school year. In a nutshell, your work and attendance counts, and you will be working in a live classroom using a video conferencing tool called Borderless Classrooms, which is kind of like Zoom, but it gives your teachers a lot more control over the content and what you do on your computer. Uh, you'll have to participate four days a week in live work, uh, with Wednesdays being a not live work day. You'll still be using Schoology to get your assignments and post your work and get updates, and if you're not attending class or posting your work, then your teachers will be reaching out to your home to follow up. So to put it another way, you are going to school. Um, just like if we were in the classroom together, there are academic and behavior expectations. Your work will be collected and graded and it will be used to determine your final grading class. So it all counts. And I, if that doesn't sound stressful to you, then that is great. It sounds stressful to me and I'm on this side of the computer. But rest assured, your teachers are doing a ton of, of training now, um, and hopefully that's going to make your transition easier. With luck and positive vibes, we will be in the classroom together before the end of the school year. More information will be sent as we get closer to the first day of school. Um, if you have any questions or concerns or you just want to say hi, uh, reach out to me through school email or even Schoology. So until the first day of school, enjoy the rest of your summer, and I look forward to seeing you. Well, hello there, everybody. Um, my name is Mr. Lear, uh, but most people most well, students, especially Brandywine High School, just call me Lear, and I will be teaching English 9 this year, both honors and CP. In addition, I'm also teaching the AVID 12 elective. I'm one of the co-coordinators for the AVID program at Brandywine, and I'm also the assistant marching band director in charge of the percussion ensemble for the marching band. So there's a lot that I do at Brandywine. Um, one of the things I've often... I take a lot of pride in it, Brandywine, is how I'm usually one of the people in the building that students can go to when they, they need support and help. And I've always kind of like taken that responsibility really seriously. And it's something that gives me a great deal of, of satisfaction. Um, so a couple things that we should go over. Even though this is going to be a different experience for everyone, you should be excited about starting this year if you're in English. It's a Brand new beginning for you freshmen and for my AVID students. It's going to be another great year. It, one of the things I want to point out that remote learning in the fall in the fall is going to be very different from remote learning in the spring. We're going to be doing live classes called synchronous. You are going to be expected to be in the classes at the at the for the whole time and to be engaged and involved. Um, and the other thing I'll go over right now is the best way to get hold of me is through email, through school email. My school email address is douglas.lear, and it's spelled L-I-E-U-X, and it's available, can be found on the Brandywine High School website, and that's the best way to get a hold of me. I will be checking email, Schoology messages, and any kind of online platform that we may be using. So, uh, 
if you have any other questions, again, you can send me an email and I'm looking forward to the experience and it should be exciting. Thank you. Hello, students and parents of Brandywine High School. This is Miss Lordy, and I'm a special educator and I teach in the ILP program with Mrs. Crowley. And we're very excited to welcome you back to a great school year. Um, it's gonna look obviously a little different online, but everything is gonna be great. We're still gonna have the same schedule and we'll fill you all in individually of what the details will look like. So we're excited to get started though, and we're excited to meet the new freshmen and welcome back to all the students that have been here. Hey Bulldogs, welcome to Brandywine High School. I'm Dr. Macarius. I teach chemistry at Brandywine High for the last 15 years of my life. I started at Brandywine in 2005. It is a very long journey. You can imagine some of you were born around that time and many of you were not even there yet. At Brandywine, I teach chemistry, two courses this year, honors chemistry and applied chemistry which is more of environmental course um, we have many digital platform ready for you and i'm so excited to meet you virtually and we'll have ongoing classes daily and hopefully soon we'll be able to meet in person and we'll have our normal daily interaction with you for those newcomer i welcome you to brandy wine for my former students I wish you the best in the new school year. Hi, Brandywine High School. My name is Jessica McCoskey, and I am the new instrumental music teacher. As the instrumental music teacher, this year I will be teaching concert band, symphonic band, steel band, music and MIDI, marching band, and music theory. This year has been really unexpected for all of us, but please rest assured that all of us are working hard in order to support you the best way that we can during this first virtual quarter. It is important that you attend every class. Although it is not required for you to have your camera on at all times, please know that we still want you to be engaged as much as possible. For me, it would be wonderful if you could set your off screen to a, an appropriate picture of yourself. That way, I can see your face and know who you are. Each learning day will consist of four periods. A days will consist of periods one, two, three, and four, and B days will consist of periods five, six, seven, and eight. There will be two A days per week and two B days per week. On Wednesdays, there will be a day for asynchronous learning. This is an opportunity for you to work on assignments that your teachers assigned previously and your teachers will be on call for any questions and concerns that you have while working through those assignments during the day. I will be communicating with you mostly through Schoology and with your parents through eSchool. Please allow up to 24 hours for me to respond to you, although it probably will not take that long. Your teachers are very busy people too, and we will probably have a lot of emails to sift through. So please make sure that you're not leaving your assignments until the last minute. Synchronous days will be conducted through a platform called Borderless Classroom. In this new platform, your teachers will have control of your device and be able to see what you're doing on your devices. This will guarantee that you are more engaged in the lessons while they are occurring. Other technologies such as Google Suite, Flipgrid, and Edpuzzle may be used throughout the quarter as well. All expectations about which technology to use will be posted in Schoology. More information about the school year ahead is coming and will be announced at our open house. In the meantime, we all wish you a happy and a healthy start to your school years and wish you all the best. Hi everyone, my name is Bernie McGuire and I will be teaching English to 9th and 11th graders this year at Brandywine High School. This is my first year at Brandywine after spending over 20 years at Springer Middle School, and I'm just really excited to be working with the great staff and students of Brandywine. Uh, go Bulldogs. 
Hi, families and students. My name is Jeannie McMullen. I am a special education teacher at Brandywine High School. I have been teaching at Brandywine since 2009. Um, I started out as an English teacher, and then a few years ago, I moved over to the special education department. Um, fun fact, I also graduated from Brandywine, so I'm pretty excited. I have a lot of bulldog pride, and I'm, I'm glad to be working at Brandywine still now. So I'm excited to work with you this fall um, on distance learning. Unfortunately, um, I have high hopes it's going to be much more successful than, than it was in the spring, and I'm really looking forward to having some engaging lessons with you and supporting you however I can. You can always email me, send me a Schoology message. Those are great ways that I'll be in contact with you, and hopefully you'll be in contact with me too. So here's to a great start to the school year. Please email with any questions or concerns. Thanks very much. Hi, how you doing? My name is Peter Meitzel. I, um, I'm new to Brandywine this year. I was at uh, Mount Pleasant for about 10, and I was at Concord for about 10 before that. This year I'll be teaching psychology slash sociology and U.S. history. Um, I will also be coaching field hockey here and assistant wrestling coach again. The thing that I like best about Brandywine is um, everybody's really pleasant. When I was coaching last year, I would have contact with different teachers and everybody just seemed so so happy and, and pleasant and welcoming. And I really that really that really really struck me. So. The other thing is, blue is my favorite color. Thanks. See you guys. Hello, students and parents. My name is Mr. Merklin, and I'm going to be the design and engineering teacher for year one and year two. I'm sitting here in our awesome facilities, and I'm really sorry that we're not going to be able to get you in to, um, to work hands-on with this stuff, at least for the first grading period. But we're trying to get you in here as soon as possible. Uh, a little bit about me, um, I have a master's degree in mechan mechanical engineering from the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign. I got my bachelor's from the University of California at Berkeley. Uh, for the last 10 years, I've been teaching secondary mathematics in Arizona. I also taught computer-aided design for four years at the University of Illinois. Recently, I just moved here from, Illinois, uh, from Arizona, and uh, it's, it's a big transition. Uh, it's a new state. It's a new district, new school, new material, new students. And, and we're doing all of this online virtually. So it's new for everyone. Um, so if you feel like you're alone, transitioning to this, this whole new kind of educational thing that we got going on virtually, you're not. We're going through this together and we're gonna get through it together. So um, there's that. Um, what else did I wanna tell you about? Uh, I guess basically I just wanted to tell you that uh, we're all here for you. Ever since moving to this state and to this district uh, and to Brandywine High School, I've had the pleasure with working with this incredibly supportive and caring staff and we're here for you. And a lot of consideration is being um, taken with to the current situation. We know how difficult this is. We know that a lot of, you know, students have a lot of other kind of things going on that uh, in some ways are more important than academia. Um, but we want you to know that we're here for you. Uh, the staff, the teachers, the administrators, principals, everyone, if you need help, please reach out. Please don't hesitate to ask me for anything and, uh, and I'll try to get you the help that you need. Now, anyway, I'm looking forward to working with you all. I'm really excited to be here and uh, we're just gonna make the best out of uh, the situation and go from there. See you soon. Hello, Brandywine. Welcome back to those of you who are returning. We miss you. And welcome new students to Brandywine High School. Welcome Bulldogs and welcome to the Bulldog family. My name is Mary Pinkston and I am a math teacher in the Mighty Math Department. And I've been teaching at Brandywine High School since 1994. And before that, I was teaching at Concord and at Mount Pleasant. And so your math question for today is, 
how old is she? So behind me, you'll see a picture of the classroom. I was at Brandywine today and one of my science friends said he was gonna use a picture of his classroom as his virtual background. And I said, that's a great idea. Now I don't have a green screen, so I'm trying not to move around too much, but I just wanted to make sure that I set the stage for us to have a great year. On September 16th, you're gonna have all eight periods and you're gonna get a chance to meet all of your teachers. And on September 17th is a one day, which means one, two, three, four. And on the next day will be a five, six, seven, eight. Don't worry if you didn't pick up any of that. Just know on September 16th, you're gonna meet all of your teachers live, synchronous, there's a word for you. There's some vocabulary that you're gonna learn really, really quick. If you're my student, then I hope to see you on September 16th. If you're not my student, I hope to see you at some point and welcome to Brandywine. Let's make it a great year. Hi everyone, my name is Mr. Rocky. I'm one of the freshman biology teachers here at Brandywine High School. And on behalf of all of the staff, uh, I wanna say welcome back to our students and our parents for another exciting school year. I promise you that your remote learning experience will be much different than it was this past fall. And all of us teachers here at Brandywine have been working extremely hard to make sure uh, that you will get the best education possible. Uh, for parents, I'll be uh, in contact with you guys on a regular basis. Uh, keep an eye out for emails for me. I'll also be providing a uh, Google Voice number um, in case parents or students need to reach out to me. Uh, for parents right now, if you need to reach out to me immediately, my email address is kyle.rodkey, last name is R-O-D-K-E-Y, and that's at bsd.k12.de.us. Uh, as for grades, um, for students, all of your grades will be posted on Schoology, and Schoology will be the primary method uh, that we will use to submit work as well. Uh, as for parents, all of the grades will be uploaded to Home Access Center, so keep an eye out on Home Access Center for any grades. Um, as for now, guys, the, in terms of video conferencing, it will be an expectation that you attend video conferencing, that you are engaged during our video conferencing. Um, uh, and, and as for now, parents, just keep an eye out for Open House, and uh, I look forward to meeting all of you very soon. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to a brand new school year. My name is Diana Rossi. I currently teach Intro to Photography, Advanced Photography, Digital Media Arts and Design, as well as your 3D Sculpture class. All of my info for the courses can be found in Schoology. Please feel free to email me at any time. Have a great school year. Hello, I'm Mr. Rulon. I teach chemistry and physics. I'm looking forward to seeing all of you folks at the beginning of the year. Uh, we've all been working hard over the last couple of weeks to uh, make sure that the instruction that we're going to be giving you this fall is a little more interactive and engaging than the remote learning in the spring. Uh, don't worry, it's not going to be all lecture for 80 minutes during class. Uh, we are going to have a mix of lecture and group and individual activity uh, during the periods. Uh, during synchronous learning, um, we are going to be using some uh, polls and some other feedback activities for attendance purposes. And each day there's going to be some kind of a formative assessment that you're going to be submitting. Uh, we will still be doing labs. Uh, we're going to have a mix of online simulations and recorded labs. For the recorded labs, you'll be making observations and recording data from the videos of the lab that was recorded, and then you'll do an analysis and submit that. If you're struggling with your work, there's the um, support period midday. Uh, you can set up a time uh, during the week to talk to me individually then. I'll also be setting up uh, some after school time on Wednesdays most weeks that you'll be able to get in touch with me. Uh, all of our class materials will be in Schoology, so links, files, resources, instructions, all of that will be in Schoology. Uh, grades will also be entered into Schoology first and then they'll get synced to eSchool. That sync will happen about uh, one or two times a week. All right, and if you need any help, make sure you reach out to me through Schoology Messages. That's the easiest way to get in touch with me, and we'll have more information for you come open house. And in the meantime, take care.
Good morning, I'm Mrs. Scarborough and I'm so excited to be teaching you this year. Many of you will be returning students as I've moved to 10th grade to teach biology and I also have a section of integrated science. I'm so excited to work with you virtually this year. We have planned a lot of fun and exciting activities to work through. Most of my work will be turned in via Schoology and that's where you can also find your grades as well as the Home Access Center. I plan to update them weekly. If you have any questions, please feel, please feel free to reach out to me via email at amanda.scarborough at bsd.k12.de.us. Hi, I'm Ralph Schmalzbach and I am a culinary arts teacher at Brandywine High School. Uh, if you are new to me, I am cool with being called Mr. Bach, but if you want to, um, you know, attempt and try, and I'm sure you'll be fine, you can call me Mr. Schmalzbach too, uh, but I'm cool with either one. Uh, for the 2020-21 school year, I will be teaching level two, advanced culinary, and level three, culinary and hospitality professional. Uh, right off the bat, Ms. Ellis and I realize in this virtual classroom setting that the um, hands-on aspect of the course, which is really what most are in my courses for, uh, to cook, uh, is really hard to implement. Um, I assure you that Ms. Ellis and I are exploring options to make labs uh, a reality, but um, you know the overall concern is uh, making sure that such is done safely and uh, with some sort of supervision, whether it be a parent or guardian. And that's tough to do, as you know, uh, when everybody is, you know, working from home and uh, so forth. So we will keep that um, as a goal of ours, um, but I can't give you assurances that we'll be doing that. But I will be doing demos, um, and I'll be recording them in my kitchen, and uh, I hope that'll be enough to engage you and to uh, hopefully bring some of the ideas and methods I'm teaching to you. Um, that being said, uh, a majority of instruction for both level two and three courses this semester will be text and video based. Um, level three students, uh, you guys will be approaching the Serve Safe certification. And we have um, made it possible to have a text uh, available to you guys um, to access so you can study it. And then in the future, you'll come back to us and you'll. Um, You'll take the test. It'll be proctored when we get back into um, Brandywine High School. Uh, if you're new to me, I promote communication and discussion when it comes to teaching, working, and supporting you. Uh, honestly, I can, I can get scattered when life gets busy. That's just me. And things definitely can still go over uh, very high over my head. Um, but understand that I work to keep things straight uh, for everyone when it comes to grading and inputting them in a timely manner into um, eSchool. But if you see that I made a mistake or forgot to input, change something, um, just ring the bell over my head and uh, I will approach. Uh, finally, honestly, I love to cook. I love to talk and learn about food history, its influences and culture, and of course I love to eat. I look forward to meeting and working with each of you during um, this upcoming school year. Um, be well and be safe. Hello, I'm Rick Shea. I'm a marketing teacher here at Brandywine High School. I teach Marketing Essentials, Marketing 2 and Marketing 3 as part of the Marketing Pathway. I'm also the Athletic Director, the Yearbook Advisor, and the Class of 2022 Junior Class Advisor. Hi there, my name is Ms. Seipel. I am the Speech Therapist and one of the Cross Country and Track Coaches here at Brandywine. I am proud to say that I graduated from Brandywine back in 2009, and this will be my fifth year working in the building. I have to say one of my favorite things about working at Brandywine has to be the friendships that I've made with so many of my coworkers. Uh, some, of, some I had even as teachers and coaches when I was a student, so that's pretty awesome. I look forward to seeing you and meeting you all very soon. 
Good afternoon, Brandywine. Welcome to the 2020-2021 school year. My name is Mrs. Small. I'm a member of the Mighty Mathematics Department at Brandywine High School. This is my 23rd year teaching and my 23rd year at Brandywine High School. This year I'm teaching pre-calculus, algebra 2, and math and personal finance. I'm looking forward to seeing some of those old faces, students I've had in the past, and looking forward to meeting some new faces, students I've never seen before. We're welcoming everybody into our classrooms on Wednesday, September 16th for an eight period day, just a short introduction. Then we're gonna get ready to roll with some new information on September 17th, which will be an A day, and September 18th, which will be a B day. There I'll be talking about borderless classroom, e-school, Desmos, all kinds of new stuff that's going to be involved in remote learning this year. It's going to be a fun year, and I look forward to seeing everybody on September 16th. Bye! Hello, my name is Chris Meter. I'm a history teacher here at Brandywine High School. I teach U.S. History and World History, um, also AP U.S. History. I'm looking forward to getting back to sort of a routine this year. I'm also looking forward to seeing students back in school sooner rather than later. Um, we're going to do a lot of interactive stuff. I will be uh, teaching like I usually do with lectures and readings and worksheets, um, but I'm hopeful that everything will become normal sooner rather than later. Best of luck to everyone this year. Hello and welcome back Brandywine High School students. It's the start of a new school year. This one's going to begin virtual, so that means we're going to be using platforms like Schoology to discuss, interact, communicate, collaborate, and learn from and with each other this year. Home Access Center is still going to be where you find your grades, but please be logging into Schoology to check your courses to see the norms and expectations for using the online software and applications that are going to allow us to interact and communicate both with our classmates and with the teachers this fall. Behind me, my classroom, I hope to have you back in in the second marking period. If you happen to be taking biology this year, my name is Mr. Stein. I am one of the biology teachers in the building here at Prandywine. Asking for patience as we excitedly welcome you back in a couple weeks to Brandywine High School. Hello, my name is Mr. Stoverschlegel, and I am the high school orchestra director in the Brandywine School District. I teach orchestra at all three high schools, Brandywine, Concord, and Mount Pleasant. And I'm really excited this year to make music with all of you who play string instruments and are going to be enrolled in orchestra. And you don't have to have been playing for a long time to be in orchestra. So if you want to be a new string instrument player, then you're more than welcome to join orchestra here at Brandywine High School. This year, I'm really excited because I get to teach some extra electives at Brandywine. I'm teaching a history of rock and roll and history of musical theater. And these are both classes that are going to explore how these different kinds of music have evolved over the time from when they began up until today. So I'm really excited to bring those to Brandywine this year and work with all of you to learn a little bit more about music. On top of these classes, I'm also going to be teaching a special orchestra, the District Symphony Orchestra. And typically when we're in person, this is an after school activity that is for anybody in the district at the high school who plays a band instrument or a string instrument. So if you are interested in maybe playing your instrument with a different group of people, including some of your friends at Concord or Mount Pleasant, then District Symphony is the place for you. And we're going to be learning about different kinds of music that you can play as a, a member of an orchestra and some things that maybe are a little bit more challenging, but also music that you probably have heard somewhere, but maybe you just didn't know where it came from. So I'm really excited to be able to make music with you this year. If you're interested in District Symphony Orchestra, please let me know. You can contact me by email using my district email, david.stoverschlegel at bsc.k12.de.us. And I really am excited to work with all of you and I hope to see you all at Brandywine High School this coming year. 
Hi, and welcome back. My name is Miss Tabron, and I will be working with English 9th and 10th grade this year. I'm a special education teacher, but I am here to help all students, so if you need anything, be sure to contact me using one of the contact methods listed below. I hope to hear from you, and cheers to a good year. Hi, this is Mrs. Tan. I am a certified secondary math teacher. I'm teaching geometry and pre-calculus this year. It is very nice to meet you. Thank you. Hello, my name is Mr. Vagnoni, AKA Mr. V, and I teach ninth grade civics and economics uh, here at Brandywine High School. And I uh, am also taking on AP government for the first time this year. I am extremely excited uh, to get started with the school year uh, as it is always an exciting time to teach a class as relevant as civics and economics, but especially so during an election year. Um, students will hopefully learn from my class how government is supposed to operate and how they can exercise their roles as citizens in the country. Uh, so just like you, uh, we are all learning how to navigate uh, the remote learning experience and various apps and tools we'll be using. Um, just know that there will be some hiccups, but that we are all here to give you guys support and make it a compelling and awesome experience. Uh, as I told my students in my goodbye messages to them last spring, uh, when I was hypothesizing on what will happen if we were to return uh, to school this fall, but you know, in a virtual setting, um, this fall's remote learning is going to be an extremely different experience uh, than what you experienced in the spring. Uh, you will be expected to attend daily classes uh, you'll be learning new material and you'll be getting graded as if you were in school on a regular day. So please treat these as if they were normal school days because they are. Uh, you will have, that's my baby, <laughs> you will have attendance taken and will be expected to be present for the video conferencing of lessons. Um, make sure that you are picking smart areas of your home to learn from, you know, cutting out distractions, being mindful of you know, what is uh, in view of the camera, and of course, dressing for success. In my class, we will be uh, having our, sorry about that. We will be having our class sessions, sessions in borderless classroom, and your materials for the class will be found on and uh, turned into on Schoology. You will find our class on your Schoology homepage, and then you'll be able to find your materials, which will be organized by topic, unit, and date. Uh, communications on your grades, behavior, and anything else will be handled via a combination of phone, phone calls and emails, uh, home access center, and Schoology messages and announcements. Uh, parents, I encourage you uh, to email me if you have any questions. Students, I'm always just a message away on Schoology. Your grades will be updated in Hack, where you can follow along with your progress in the class. Uh, more information on how our class, my class specifically, and Brandywine High School in general operate, uh, will be coming uh, as we rev up the engine to get this school year going. So to, call, to all of my incoming freshmen, welcome to Brandywine High School and go Bulldogs. Hi, my name is Judd Wagner and I have the privilege to teach physics and engineering here at Brandywine High School. What I love most about Brandywine is the brilliant staff that is completely devoted to the profession and the education of their students. I love that this is a comprehensive high school where everything from the arts and the humanities to anything STEM is accessible to every student. And most of all, I love our diverse student population with a vibrant spectrum of hopes and dreams. In a nutshell, that's why I love Brandywine. Hello, welcome to Brandywine High School. My name is Miss Walker and I teach English at Brandywine. This year I will be teaching ninth grade English classes and freshman seminar. I am excited to get to know each one of you. Hello, welcome to the 2020-2021 school year. I'm Mrs. Washington, a special education teacher at Brandywine High School. This will be my second year at Brandywine High. Um, some of you will see me in your history classes this year, U.S. History, Civics, and Economics. I'm excited to meet you all. look forward to seeing you all soon. Hi, everybody. My name is Ms. Wilson, uh, and I'm joining you from the beautiful Brady Wine High School Library, recently renovated. 
Um, first, I'd like to welcome all our ninth grade students and all our new students. Um, and I'd also like to welcome back uh, all our returning students. Um, I am Brandywine High School's librarian. I also teach AP research and I help out with some of the school-wide testing. Um, I would like you to know that if you have any kind of question that I can help you with, so you have a research question, you have a reference question, um, maybe a simple technology question. If you reach out to me either through email or message me on Schoology, um, I'll set up a one-on-one -on -one time where we can address that question. And if we need you know, someone outside of me, we'll get additional help. Uh, if you are my, one of my AP research students, um, I post a lot on Schoology, so the syllabus and what we're doing the first week will be up before September 16th. And then on September 16th, if you're logged on um, with your school credentials on your school issued Chromebook, I'll be able to pull you into class and we'll get started from there. Um, the best way to reach me is either through email or um, a Schoology message. Uh, I hope everyone has a great year, and I hope to see people in person soon um, in the Brandywine High School Library. Thank you. Hi, everybody. It's Mrs. Wilt. If you're new to Brandywine, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. Um, again, I'm Mrs. Wilt, and this is my 26th year in education. This year, I'm teaching Statistics and Probability, AP Stat, Exploring Computer Science, AP Computer Science Principles, and AP Computer Science A. Super excited to see everyone, even if it is on a computer screen. And your teachers and I have been working really hard to plan our lessons to make this an exciting year. You can see all the cool apps that we have here. We've been trained in Google Suite and I've got AP Classroom that my AP students will join. We're going to be using Borderless Classroom. So everybody's getting a Chromebook. Edpuzzle is pretty cool. I've used that before. And then Desmos for our calculator, although I'm trying to get some TI calculators for my AP students. So some things haven't changed. We're still using Home Access and Schoology, but obviously we won't be running classes the way we did last spring. So it's going to be challenging, but what about 2020 hasn't? So I'm looking forward to taking this journey with you, and I'll see everybody soon. Bye. Hi everyone, my name is Katie Winters and I teach AP Literature as well as English 12 and English 12 Honors here at BHS. I'm looking forward to getting to know each and every one of my students through our live synchronous, meaning real-time, classes. Um, and like every year, I'm looking forward to getting to know my students through their writing. Each class's Schoology page will be regularly updated with class activities, instructions, assignments, and help. So this year that might look like troubleshooting if you are using a new digital tool um, or instructions or answers to general questions. Schoology is also where all students will submit their assignments, uh, whether those assignments are small or large. Just a reminder that we'll use the new tool Borderless Classroom for our live synchronous lessons. And you can still check, you will still check Home Access Center for your grades, just like you would in a non-virtual start school year. Um, in regards to our live classes, I just want all of my, my future students to rest assured that I will not talk at you for 80 minutes. Um, that's not how people learn and it's really important to me that my class still remains student-centered um, even though it will be virtual or digital. So that means you will be thinking, working, creating um, the vast majority of the time or sharing with your classmates. Um, if you need to contact me, you can reach me via Schoology message or you can send me an email at katie, K-A-T-I-E, 
Winters at bsd.k12.de.us. You can also find my email address on the Brandywine High School webpage. Um, and I'm really looking forward to another great year of reading and writing. Hi, everybody! Welcome! I'm Amy Wolf. I'm Mrs. Wolf. I am your fitness education teacher and your health teacher if you are a sophomore. This is my virtual classroom. Welcome. Um, you are seeing my workspace area for now and virtually. I can't wait to see you guys in person. So how long have I been teaching here at Brandywine? I've been, this is my seventh year and I'm so excited. The seven years have gone, or the six years prior have gone by real quick. One of my favorite things about being a Bulldog is all of the awesome teachers that I work with. I work with Mr. Julian, he's the other fitness education teacher and lifetime fitness teacher. And I work also with uh, Mrs. Brown, she's the dance teacher and the fitness education teacher. Last but not least, I so look forward to meeting you in person. But this is what we gotta do now. So let's dig in, let's get our hands dirty and our feet wet, and let's get this party started. Hi, Brandywine community. I'm Karen Zellis. I teach culinary and hospitality management an early childhood teacher academy. I've been at Brandywine High School for 13 years. And the one thing I love most about being a Bulldog is all the great students I have in my class every year. I'm looking forward to seeing you soon.